Well, this is Baruch Fleischman here at the Tikkun Elevator Kolel, and we've been moving along in five minutes a day, or less, hopefully. Unpartious Pinchas, and we're gotten to the place here on Shin Lamed Aleph. It's a short piece, but maybe it's a little bit involved. So let's see what we can do in the time that we have, and that's what we'll do. So the Zohar starts like this. We've been talking about the digestive system. We've been talking about how the the lobes of the lungs or the wings of the lungs, they are waterers. And we went through the heart and the kidneys, and we went through the spleen and different places where to come over here, talk about it again. The, the spleen takes all of the leftovers of everything. Now, what, what shmarm is he talking about? The spleen takes all of the shmarm. The haina es a moiser ha nishar me call ha shefa ha nishman bazun. That is, it takes all of the, the extra that is left over from the shefa that was poured into zun. This is taken by the female seductress, which is the concept of the female aspect of the Sitra Achra. Everything that you see in Kabbalah is always male and female, even if it doesn't say it. But there's always a male-female side. The female side of the uh, of the Sitra Achra is called the Lamad Lamad. And we've, I've seen it pronounced as the Plonis. They don't want to say her name. And this is the name of what's the seductress do? Well, let's say you're sitting doing whatever and a, a terrible thought comes into your mind and you write it. Let's just say it's a it's a thought, a dirty thought. Where does this come from? It comes from her. Because that's who she is. She is the seductress. And we're what do what we're doing is we're pours personalizing a force, which is really by giving her a name, let's say. By giving her a name and but it's a part of us. That's what we want to say. That this Polonis is really a part of something that's attached to us. The Mishari in the law also it also affects and it's, it goes to her encampments that she has many different emissaries to carry out what she wants to do. Kihi aim the call machnel tzachitzayne because she, that is this Pallone, is this enticer, the seductress. She is the mother of all of the encampments, the holts, the armies of the kitzayne. The in and the bad of shvachos because in actually all of these are slaves, are male slaves and female slaves. In other words, they're servants or they're indentured. Shehem Nequayim Avadim Veshvacho is the call by those names. The Arma Alaik Shlomo, the Shlomo says about them, Shalechem Amar Shlomo Amelech, Kanisi Li Avadim Veshvacho, I have acquired for myself slaves or male and female servants. So he says, What does he mean that he acquired them for himself? He said, Bepir Shehikniya as Machna Zakitzainim, that he humbled and he beat down the encampments that is the full force of the army of the Kitsonian that come to attack us. So, so now we're over here in the Zohar. It says, V'amar Od, and it says further, Tre Kulian, let's look at your kidneys. Let's understand the metaphor of the kidney. Kishte Kalaha Kalai is the two kidneys, Shehem Sod Shne Malachi Adin, because they are actually the, the secret of two angels of din. Din, in other words, channels for that, that work to filter out and to bring down din, shalomalchus. Shen emer aleichem, because it's written about them, misharshav, misharsav, his servants, esh locate, are a fire which is burning. It's kriya ishim, and they're called these malachim of, of the, which were represented by the kidneys, who are ultimately a refining, refining, refining. He says, it's Korea Ishim, they're called fires. Al Shem Ishim de la because of the fires that come from up above. What is that? Aim Nikwaim Ishim. Ishim because they're from the side of Din. Al Shem Shah Ishim, Shahim Malachi Za, Shalomala, they're Malachim on the left side is their Anben, which brings down all of these Dinim. The Itma Bahu that is reset in regards to them, Shalem Ishe Hashem, Vanachalasa Yachelu, that this is the Pasuk over here. And he says, the fire of Hashem and his inheritance, they will eat that. The Haina Malachi Avaya. So what does it say when he says Malachi Avaya? Avaya is another way for another word for Zer Anpin. And that's where we stand right now. This is Baruch Fleischman. With this five minute, it's less today. This shear of, of the, on the, on Parsha's Pinchas for the Tikkun Elevator call out.